news on the run in southeastern Mass. So here's the thing. If you see the big bird, call authorities. Our Jennifer Pinate is live in the little town of Menden tonight, hearing from a community on the hunt. Yeah, Ed and Maria, where those emu, emus are tonight is a complete mystery, along with where they came from. We do know that it was not from the Southwick Zoo. All we know is that hikers spotted them right here in these woods before running off in complete shock. They may not be on TV yet. Emmanuel Todd Lopez. Or gone viral on TikTok like these high profile emus. It's kind of exciting. Unbelievable. So incredible. But two mystery emus are now the talk of the town in Menden. What would an emu be doing around here? Blackstone Animal Control says hikers ran into the five foot tall birds today along a trail in the Menden Town Forest, which spans 120 acres. Officers don't know where the flightless birds are or who they belong to. There's lots of farms around here, but if it didn't come, I have no idea. Yeah, no, I would say the zoo, but if it's not the zoo. Maybe somebody had an exotic animal in their backyard. People who live near the trailhead around Chestnut Hill Road and Millville Street are on the lookout. I mean, we haven't seen anything yet, but we're looking. Runaway emus are not a rare sight in Massachusetts. Surveillance video captured one last year in Brockton, another one roaming around Lakeville, and Blackstone Animal Control wrangled an emu on the lamb several months ago. Those in Menden hope they're caught before they run into the emus. The Australian bird can sprint up to 30 miles an hour. I think I think it would be a little intimidating. And thank you for checking in on us in, in our emu uh, catastrophe. Emu catastrophe. Well, if these large animals on the large are yours, or if you happen to see them, make sure that you call authorities.